Naked Rancher here for my Women Rancher series. And this one, a very personal one for me because it's about Constance Douglas Reeves, who we all knew as Connie. Her grandfather was big rancher out in Marathon, Texas, but her father was a judge out of the Eagle Pass area in Texas. It was her grandfather that gave her her first horse when she was young. She wanted to be a lawyer like her father, so was one of the first women to go to the University of Texas and get her law degree. She didn't take the bar because she had to move back to San Antonio during the depression to not only make money for the family as a teacher, but help her father through sickness. During that time period, a woman by the name of Ora Johnson opened a girls camp in the hill country called Camp Waldemar. She wanted Connie to come and run the horseback riding department and Connie turned it down for a few years. When she finally went out, she never left. While there, she fell in love with the head cowboy whose name was Jack Reeves. Her family didn't approve of it and disowned her. She chose a life of a cowboy. She spent her adult life there taking care of the horses that were part of Camp Waldemar. She was married to Jack for over 40 years when he passed away. She continued to ride horses horses until she was 101, just a few months short of her 102nd birthday. She was thrown off of her horse. Dr. Pepper was enough to bring this strong woman down. She rode every day of her life and lived exactly the way she wanted. She not only taught generations of families, specifically mine, my mother, myself, and my daughters. She has the following awards, and for me, no less an amazing, wonderful person and woman rancher. Connie is known for this saying, always saddle your own horse. And that is her. Make a rancher out.